The Bible says, come to the throne of grace that you may obtain. My only problem, as I always tell you, is that I do not know whether what you obtain, you can retain. Will you retain what you will obtain? Yes. Ask your neighbor, will you retain it? Yes. You know, the greatest danger in Christianity is the speed at which people lose whatever they receive. But the greatest secret is in retention. Ability to keep it moving. Because you can never be kept by what you never keep. It is what you are able to keep that can keep you. You know this morning we normally talk about the administration. And I'm not going to talk about it today. Because I've been asked several questions by young people this week. But I can tell you this. As a believer in this church you must be very careful how you hear. Young people have been asking me, you prayed for David President Gashawa. What went wrong? Nothing has gone wrong. Nothing has gone wrong. The only thing we will pray about is what is about to happen. I see skirmishes. But I divert them and I reduce the damage. There are things God can show you, but you have no ability to change them. But you are given the grace to reduce their negative impact. That's why Jesus said there could have been destruction in Jerusalem. Thank God that the days have been reduced. This you must know. That arrogance and pride are resisted by God. <laughs> this you must know. But humility is the answer for your greatness. <laughs> However big you become, the moment arrogance and pride are introduced, you are resisted by God. And God humbles the proud and erases the humble. Ask your neighbor, are you complicated? What I have not said is what you have not heard. But as far as I'm concerned, I've answered every question in this country. Praise God. Always be humble. Be humble. If you remain silent, nobody can quote you. But if you speak, you can be quoted. Equally, if you take no action, there will be nothing to manifest. But every single action manifests. That's why faith without action is dead. There is nothing spoken in silence as they lie to us. Silence is just sometimes a sign of wisdom, but not a speech. The Bible does not say, be an example in silence. It says, be an example in speech. You can go through at the time because of your mistake. You can go through at the time because of what is orchestrated by others. But at the time is at time. If your child drives your car and is not a driver, then the car is involved in an accident. When you are mature, you take the child to hospital. Then later you come to repair the car. That family requires our prayer. Because of what they are going through this week. Sometimes we go through difficult times because of our weaknesses. Other times we go through hard times because of our wickedness. Both weakness and wickedness can be an avenue for disappointment. I want you to take a moment in this atmosphere. In a sincere heart, you pray for the family of Pastor Dorcas Degathi and His Excellence Rikathi Kashawa. We don't pray for people because they are our friends, but because they belong to our God. Can you please lift up your hands and mention a prayer to this family, this our Father? 
We bless your holy name. Mention a prayer this hour. See, and I wish you kind of wow. You stay with the family of His Excellency Rigathi Kashawa and the Pastor Dorcas that you empower them again, give them a reason to live again. There is nothing that is beyond you. We pray for them. We speak a blessing over them. Father, empower them. They should not lose faith. Let them not lose faith in you. In Jesus' mighty name we are praying. Kanami ni seko tano Usi ni ache sani jina la Yesu Kristo na kushukuru kwa sababu hakuna Mungu mwingine kama wewe kanisa hili linakubaliana na wewe katika kila jambo na kila safari na pia ulituweka hapa kwa sababu ya taifa la Kenya na kwa jina tukufu la Yesu lenye mamlaka na uweza na lifunika taifa la Kenya na damu yako ninakataa mipango yote ya umwaikaji wa damu na kataa mipango yote ya kukatwa vichwa na kataa mipango ya haina yoyote ya furugu na vita natangaza amani na ushindi na neno hili litatimia kwa jina la Yesu tumeomba na kuamini amen amen